go now to our breaking news. A big rig crash on I-5 and French Camp Road in Stockton. And let's go live right now to KCR 3's Brian Hickey with uh, more details on what's happening out there now. Brian, good morning. Yeah, good morning to you guys. So this is the northbound side of I-5. This ramp right here behind me, this is the ramp, the off-ramp to Matthews Road. And you can see here on the shoulder of the road, a big rig on its side. The trailer used to be down off the embankment here. In fact, you can see the rear axle of the trailer uh, just sitting down here. They've pulled the trailer up onto the road, a trailer that was full of produce and a bunch of other uh, ingredients and all of that spilled through the roof of this trailer, a 53 foot trailer. The roof ripped off as it flipped over and dumped it all down the embankment of the road here. I'm told 75,000 pounds of produce and other goods. So for now, they're working to upright the truck and they'll come back by daytime and clear all of this out. You can see off in the distance, Caltrans has shut down the slow lane here on the northbound side of I-5 coming through Matthews to allow the uh, big rig tow company here a safe place to try to upright this truck. And that is work that is underway right now, but it's gonna take some time. So this is definitely slowing down the northbound side. Fortunately, uh, the heavier traffic is on the southbound side with folks heading through Tracy. So what caused all of this? Well, the driver says he was trying to avoid horses that were on the freeway. And right now, animal control is off in the distance there. You can see that truck with the amber lights parked there. They found five horses and corralled them into that field. Fortunately, the driver was not injured in this overturned big rig uh, incident here, but they are keeping those horses off of the freeway. I don't know if any horses were injured, but obviously a pretty big mess here on the side of the freeway as they work to clear all of this up. Live in French Camp, Brian Hickey, KCRA 3 News.